Mafio, how are you doing? What do you think about Israel bombing Iran embassy declaration of war officially? Right? Hold on tight. There's a reason gold is hitting new highs. Right? Silver is starting to kick up. It's breaking out. Silver is breaking out. Gold is breaking out. There's like the market is telling you we're going into World War Three. Prepare accordingly. Okay. Full on. The there's a mad dog on the loose in the world okay israel has decided to wage war on humanity on the globe right and there's a whole they've they they're assuming they've uh, made their moves in the proper way to have whoever they puppets they want placed in the western world as leaders to be able to do what they want to do which is genocide right which which is what they're doing right they're assuming they're going to get away with it my assumption is they're not my assumption is that israel committed suicide or put it more clearly zionists just murdered israel now it's going to be up to real moral honest uh caring those who actually give a rat's ass about israel and judaism especially jews to depose these fanatical zionist supremacists to get rid of them and hold them accountable you can't just say oh okay we're not allowing them to do it anymore not enough right you need to arrest all of them prosecute them for war crimes prosecute them for uh genocide make sure that you can apply the appropriate penalty to them right they must pay the highest price possible for what they have done no questions asked that's where we are there is no turning back now Rubik cross the Rubicon use red line whatever analogy you want to you want to use Israel has been telling the world what they're doing and the world right the superpowers the one reason they're doing this is because they have the full support backing of the United States of America right that means the United States of America is complicit not only complicit but actually helping to commit genocide they're giving them logistics they're giving them weapons they're backing them up it, united states is now participating in committing genocide right so i hope people appreciate that right canada just pulled out canada said okay we're out fucking you you fucking lunatics gone too far you guys are fucking nuts right we're like canadian government is a piece of shit nuts supremacists not supremacists but world elitist let's say globalist world economic forum consider humanity to be garbage and they just want to control everything they're fucking evil the canadian government but israel has gone so fucking evil that the evil canadian government just went we're out like fuck no right the the, the repercussions of this are insane which is basically you after world war ii i think they hanged all those who participated in committing genocide right i think those laws are still in place so canadian government went what the fuck we're out right uh so people should appreciate this israel is desperate to kickstart world war three we're on world war three but they want it to be hot they want iran to join right they they they, they, they want russia to go further right they want china to join neocons as well right because that's their last card they need to play economically the western world is annihilated it's fucking done right it's done right that their attack on russia and their failure to collapse russia and take over the resources of russia right and make sure they could use the us dollar and the swift swift system to destroy any country they wanted to including the world's largest nuclear power which would have been russia they failed in that endeavor and now the world is going fuck you motherfuckers you guys been bullying the world for fucking decades now we got someone that's stepping up and saying fuck you they drew the line and they fucking annihilated you to a level where uh, mali niger senegal they just told france to fuck off right that's where we are appreciated israel is not going to stop at some point iran will officially join the battle my assumption it might be a false flag committed by mossad to get iran they're pushing really hard right now they attack the iranian embassy something 
with U.S. troops involved, and then it's fucking free for all. Okay, at, and when that happens, gang, you're gonna see gold go up thousand dollars, silver double. Okay, cryptos. We'll see how it goes. What depending on what type of false flag and attack it is, is it going to be cyber? Is it going to be something else? So different things will happen. There's different. You know, if you game the system, there's multiple different avenues you can go that I've thought about. I'm pretty sure there are fucking a couple of orders of magnitude more than that that I haven't thought about, right? So, oh, and shipping, shipping traffic stops, and all of a sudden there's shortages of everything. So prepare. Funds, food, water, community, fucking whatever you need. That's where we are. And by the way, this can stop any time that the world decides. All they have to do is put a nuzzle on that fucking mad dog in the Middle East, which is the Zionist state of Israel, and make sure you cut the leash in the United States that you have on that mad dog in Israel. Right? So the United States has to say, we're done, we're out, just like Canada, we're out. Right? UK has to do the same and let the mad dog be dealt with, right? Hopefully, peacefully. 